YouTube welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video I'm so excited to be back into the swing of things thank you so much for all your lovely support and feedback and comments and love um, since getting back into it I'm so happy with how it's going and really really excited to get back into just sharing everything that happens in life like I always used to and yeah it's really fun and i'm loving it and today is no different i have a clothing haul for you guys which is another one of my favorite videos to film besides the vlogs and all that kind of thing so today is obviously a collaboration with princess polly again which i'm so excited about as always today's theme i was trying to think about this because i like to sort of introduce it with like what i was thinking when i was choosing my items but a lot of the time it's a bit all over the place but I still sort of have an idea in mind of what I want so today's vibe is sort of like me trying to keep up with the trends and just trying to fill my wardrobe with like pieces that I can sort of make look really cool but while still being like my style and super comfy and super casual and like really easy to style while still looking trendy and cool if that makes sense so there's a couple of pieces in there that I just like really really love and just will always choose because it's just so me and so my style but yeah it's me being Ellie Kate style while also trying to keep up with the trends and be trendy because Princess Polly has the most trendy stuff and it all always looks so cool on the models so yeah every haul I do now I'm just trying to like be them and it's so fun but a little bit like out of my comfort zone sometimes like <laughs> this is one particular thing you know what let's start with it let's get started so let's get started this first thing that I have for example out of my comfort zone this is a bucket hat guys a bucket hat <laughs> so I got a bucket hat because I wanted to get a hat right for the beach because I don't really have one I have a cap but like caps eh. so I wanted to get like a big nice broad brim like a straw or like a felt or something like that big broad brim hat super cute but they're like a little bit like more expensive than what I thought they were I don't know why and I really wanted to choose more clothes and stuff like that so to have the hat covered off I got um, a cheaper bucket hat so this is what it looks like <laughs> I feel like when I fold it up like this it looks like those hats that you wear with a raincoat like the whole like the yellow ones that you wear but I also kind of like it oh it keeps falling down I need to like have it like because I have it hanging folded up there I need to like leave it sitting like this so that it stays like that I don't know I just I got a bucket hat okay <laughs> I actually think it's so cute and the model like looks amazing in it and I think I just need to like style it right with like some cool beach outfit and that sort of thing but yeah it's pretty cool it has frayed edges I'll show you in more detail so you, in case you guys are interested it has frayed edges and it's like a little bit larger than your normal bucket hat which is why I chose it because I am have a larger than normal head oh that looks better I think you just need to like gently place it actually that looks so cute like that now not with this outfit it's weird but still that's cute they also have other bucket hats which I was very tempted to get that are made of towel material so they're called like the toweling bucket hat came in baby pink and baby blue as well which I really want to get and it was the material of a towel so like that fluffy sort of stuff whereas this is just plain canvas there we go beautiful so yes that is a good example of me trying trends trying to keep up the trends without looking like a loser and just you know also being sun safe I'm probably just gonna put this over my head like that when I lay down on the beach on the sand that's pretty much what it's gonna be useful but I could also look trendy if I choose to if I try put effort in anyway that's that <laughs> So moving past the bucket hat, I'm going to move the camera a bit so you can see the outfit I'm wearing right now and get into the clothing haul. I really think I have, no, I didn't get any other accessories this time besides the bucket hat. So very excited about all the clothing and all the styles I've chosen this month. You can use my discount code XOLE20 for 20% off. And yeah, it's got a little while before it expires, so it'll still be summer for all of my Aussie and Southern Hemisphere babes. If you want to choose any of these pieces, I'll leave all the links down below with the sizes that I got, and I'll sort of explain my sizing as well as we go along, because as we know, I'm a little bit of an in-betweener size at the moment. 
just in general actually. <laughs> So yes, I'll leave the link to just the Princess Polly website at the top, my um, discount code and everything in the description. Don't forget you can use Afterpay and all that good stuff at the checkout, which is always risky. I even did that for one of these things that I'm going to show you as well. I'll explain it all very soon. Let's just get straight into it. Okay, so I'm already wearing the first outfit that I want to show you for this haul because I honestly haven't taken it off all weekend. I love it so much and it's, you know, one of those outfits where you look at what the model's wearing and you just love it so much that you buy like all the different things that she's wearing so you can like complete the outfit. That's what I've done here. Not completely, but pretty much. I bought like the exact same um, crop top that she was wearing underneath this jumpsuit and it's so cute I love it so much so I'll show you the this is actually called a play suit jumpsuit it's a long I'm pretty sure this is the play suit oh it's overalls what am I talking about it's overalls because it's got pants I don't know oh no they're overalls because they're like over I don't know you've got eyes you can see <laughs> so this is what they look like they're like a really beautiful squiggly sort of zebra print like it still gives me animal print vibes but it's not exactly an animal if that makes sense it's a really really nice lightweight material super thin super lightweight very very comfortable and a very nice feel because it is that loose baggy sort of fit it's got a pocket at the front which is super cool super handy it actually works it's not like a fake pocket the um, straps are attached at the back there and then you tie them into the holes at the front. I would ideally like this to be tied a little bit tighter just so it's not quite so gapy there. Um, but my boyfriend tied these up yesterday and I don't know how he did it so I'm just going to leave it because I really like it. But yeah, I would re-tie them a bit tighter every time I put them on. But yeah, that is what they look like. Yeah, nice and gapy which I actually kind of like because it makes the bottom half of the shorts sit like how it's meant to like I really like that look also got real pockets on the bottom half as well which is freaking awesome they're cuffed at the bottom which is super cute and I actually paired these with brand new high top connies because I just couldn't not get them because I knew it would look so cute with this outfit the model was actually wearing those really trendy new like really low block heels with like all the different thin straps going across her foot so she was wearing like little black heels which would be so cute to dress it up but i think connie's are great for just everyday cash wear now this is their basic um white crop from princess polly it looks super cute i don't know if it's just me but to me it looks really gray on camera i hope it's not showing up like that because it's just a normal bright white cropped tee comes down to here really nice fit um, I got the T in a size 8 and as you can tell by the seams on the shoulders I could easily get a 10 and it would fit like how it's meant to around the shoulders like shoulder seams are meant to be like a bit more out here but I still really like it because it's super tight and super cropped on me but yeah definitely could go a 10 and that would probably be my like real size if that makes sense but I get an 8 in some things if I feel like it the jumpsuit is a 10 because I'm a long human and I want it to fit nicely around the crotch area and not come in half but obviously you can adjust the height of it entirely and the tightness with tying the strap so if I tied it up here like this it would be hips tighter and a little bit shorter as well so that's obviously completely adjustable no matter what size you get and yeah this is definitely 10 out of 10 outfit for me I love it so much it is so comfortable yet so cute and it looks like you put so much effort in just when you have like not that much on like you didn't really have to put that much thought into it because it's just a jumpsuit and it already is like a two piece in one so yeah definitely a win out for me the next piece I have to show you is these beautiful little um, shorts. I don't know what you would call them. They're sort of, um, actually I think they're 100% linen, like cotton. I don't know, is linen made out of cotton or if, is it like its own thing? I'm not sure, but it's that sort of materials. Linen shorts, they were called khaki shorts. But they're definitely more of an army green in person, which I don't like army green as much, but... I've had these on for a little bit now and I actually really like them especially because the fit is so nice and they look really good with like a little tight crop and I've still got my Connie's on which look really cool with it as well but they're such a nice fit the most amazing material for like putting over togs at the beach or just everyday wear like this outfit that I have on right now they are amazing I have a size 10 on right now you can see 
where they come up to. Super high waisted and super long on the bum, so they're not letting anything show. I probably definitely could fit a size 8, they'd obviously just be shorter and not as high waisted. Um, but yeah, I really like these, super comfortable, and they've got pockets, obviously. I love pockets so much, I always put my hands in pockets. And very practical, they've got a long drawstring and a really nice elastic waist. Just very nice, everyday shorts. Perfect for when you don't want to wear denim and you want to be really comfy, they're the best. Okay, this next look is definitely something I've wanted to wear for so long and I finally bit the bullet and did it. Honestly, first of all, I'd like to say this would look so much better with a fake tan on and I really wish I tanned for all of the pieces that I chose in this haul. But anyway, I'm just going to ignore that. It's my natural skin colour, so it's still fine. Embrace your pastiness, everyone. But yeah, definitely going to put a tan on if I wear this like in public next time. But um, <laughs> this whole look is from... Princess Polly top and shorts, but it's mainly the shorts that I've just been eyeing off for the longest time ever. These are the Thrills mum style denim shorts. I can't remember what exactly they're called to them, but obviously they're the mum length. They're like that length at school where they say like, has to go past your fingertips. Like these would be school appropriate. Very funny that these, like everything's come full circle and it's like real like, everything like mum style and like old fashioned and all that is like coming back in trend. It's very cool, but yeah. How amazing is it that like shorts that like you can actually wear to like school free dress days or like the trend now. So yeah, anyway, they are washed light black colour. They're not solid black and they're not dark black. They're like really washed out, which I really like. Very trendy and they have um, distressing at the bottom. So it's like someone's like chopped them. And they've got little threads and everything, which is really cool. And they're very nice and high waisted. Very nice fit at the top. These are a size 10 and they fit perfectly. I was worried they'd be too baggy around the thighs and be like not the shape that they're meant to be, but they fit me so, so well. Highly recommend. Um, and what else to say about them? I don't know. I just think they're so cool. I feel like <clears throat> these shorts like dressed up with any sort of outfit with like a little crop or I saw actually a lady in the shopping center yesterday with a big white button linen up shirt that she had like so tucked in tied in a knot with it which would look so cool and I just feel like anything that you dress with these shorts looks really like effortless but still trendy and cool so I'm very much about these shorts again got the connies on with this outfit which I think looks so cool and the top I've got on is just the Athens little white crop with the red logo in the middle. I just thought this was a nice addition for something that I can match with this. So it's still plain and the shorts are definitely like the statement, but it's still a nice little crop that's not like too basic and you're not just wearing like black and white, if that makes sense. It's still got a little bit of red. Um, yeah, I just think it's a really cool outfit and I really can't wait to wear it when I have a fake tan on. <laughs> Okay, the next piece is just this t-shirt, which I am so obsessed with. It's just one of the Thrills oversized tees. Again, I literally choose one of these in every single haul because they always bring out new stuff in the coolest styles and the coolest colours and prints and everything. And oversized tees with denim shorts is literally my go-to outfit. Like, it's so comfortable, so easy. Still look very trendy because I always pick, like, one of the newer ones that come out and I just... I love it so much. I just put it on with the shorts that I just showed you and it's such a cool outfit. I love it. It's actually one of a sh like one of the very few shirts that I think I could just wear hanging out like this. But whenever I have an oversized shirt, I usually do just the little drop tuck where I literally just like suck my belly and pull my pants out and then drop the shirt in. And that's like how I tuck it just so it's not like it doesn't look like you literally like tucked in your shirt all the way around. But it just gives you like a little bit more shape so you can see the top of the shorts. So that's how I would wear it. Or with this one, it's a very soft, smooth, thin cottony material. I would definitely tie it in a knot as well. Super easy to tie in a knot. It's not one of those like bulky, chunky ones that's going to like give you a big knot at the front. So that is also definitely a vibe. And the sleeves are a little bit cuffed. It's just a little tiny cuff, which I think is beautiful. Not too big, so it doesn't make your shoulders look real bulky. But it's just very nice detail. I also can't remember what size I got in this because I literally pick and choose it anywhere between a 6 and a 10 with big oversized t-shirts. I think this one's a 10 because it is, like, a bit bigger. But, yeah, it's so cute and it's that really nice, thin, silky cotton, like I said. And just so comfy and cool and I absolutely love it. 
So you've probably also noticed I can't go a Princess Polly haul without choosing a Wrangler tee as well. Literally my two favourite brands of oversized tees or just normal, normal shaped tees but like really cool colours and prints again. Like these colours are so beautiful and like so my vibe. Like the mustard and then like the pastel pinks and blues. I just love it so much. It honestly reminds me of like... I don't want to get the era wrong, but like this is what my mum would sort of wear. I was going to say like 80s. I don't know if she was a teenager in the 80s. I feel like she would have been. Um, but Or 90s. No. Yeah, 80s. I don't know. But yeah, I feel like these sort of colours and like this like stripe going across ways in a t-shirt is like so something she would have worn when she was young, which I love. And I put them on with the same shorts again, but I actually think to make this a little bit less old school vibes, you could go 100% old school vibes and go like maybe blue in these sort of shorts like a blue denim long long denim or like really baggy big mum jeans would look very like old school which would be really cool but I think I would put this with like my white frilly skirt to make it like a bit more like cutesy and bring out like the pastel colours or um, little white shorts white denim anything like that I think would look super cute or just blue denim shorts but yeah this one isn't as oversized it's still like it's a very straight cut but it's got longer sleeves and it's just super nice. It's a little bit thicker, but still really, really soft. I just love the quality of these shirts. Could also tie in a knot, which would be super cute. Yeah, I either go a tuck or a knot with like every single shirt ever. <laughs> so that's what it looks like with a knot. A little bit less baggy, but still enough to knot it. And it's just very cute. Here's a close up of the colors for you all. Absolutely love this one. 10 out of 10. Sorry, I definitely can't do a Princess Polly haul without taking a little peek at the mini dresses and the party dresses and all the really beautiful fun stuff. Even though I honestly don't get dressed up that often, which is why most of the things I choose are always like casual shirts and casual shorts and stuff that I can just chuck on whenever because the only time I wear normal clothes is if I need to leave the house on a Sunday or something like that but I still always get one nice at least one nice little dressy outfit because usually I'll find an event that I can wear it to and this one is just so beautiful that I have to wear it to something soon like I just this is actually a set so this isn't a set section because I really wanted some like nice like either going out sets that you can wear like separately as well or like comfy casual sets but this one just like I literally just could not leave it there so I had to choose this it is so so cute it is a white um like that I don't know what material that is called but it's like that almost no I literally have no idea but it's like that stuff that's a bit see-through I'll show you so that's my fingers through it so it's a little bit thin and sheer so it has to have like white lining underneath, which I'll show you right there. So that's what that is, if, if you can imagine what that material is that I'm trying to explain. But yeah, it is a two-piece mini skirt and little tie-up top. It's one of those tops that you can tie up in the middle and at the straps. So it's very, very versatile and adjustable to all sizes. I got a 10 in the set. Obviously, you have to choose the same size for top and bottom and I probably could have fit into an H just because I definitely have plenty of fabric here where I could have like I tied it as tight as I could and I could have probably got an H just because it is so adjustable and you can tie it as tight as you need and the skirt is one of those ones that doesn't have elastic at the top but it just tapers in nicely and has a zip up the side so that's how you get that one on and then it has this beautiful little tie down the side with like one of those things that you like pull up as high as you want it and then you tie it to keep it there. I don't know how to explain that either. It's got some different layers and little ruffles on all different angles which makes it look beautiful. But yeah, just with the waist size and the size of the top I probably could have fit a size 8 in this set just because it is more versatile than what I, I guess I thought it was maybe. I don't know. But yeah, it's still absolutely beautiful and obviously still so wearable for me. Alright, this lucky last piece that I have is actually a little bonus. I didn't even get this one in that big order that I just showed you. I ordered this one like a week before because I've seen it absolutely everywhere. All of my favourite girls, even some of my like actual friends from real life, <laughs> as well as girls on Instagram, have been wearing this to death. And it also comes in other colours, which other girls have been wearing as well. 
and every time I go on the website it's always sold out in the small to extra small size because obviously it's so popular I see everyone have it um, so when I saw that it was in stock I literally just bought it straight away without even a second thought so I wanted to show you it because I still haven't worn it yet it's only been like a week and I really want to wear it to the beach because I just feel like that would be so so cute um, but yeah just for everyday wear it's so beautiful as well so basically I need to get into talking about the actual dress show you how long it is there we go it is this massive like almost a t-shirt style dress but obviously like super super flowy has stitching through the middle where it becomes really baggy and like what's the word like crunched together that's not the word like pun bunched bunched together that's the word it's got big pockets really deep v here which you can obviously wear without togs and just like a normal bra underneath because it's not too low but obviously if you had fun togs on or you had like a high like bralette or something that would look really cute but you can just wear it without anything and it still comes and sits nicely there it's got some buttons which are actually real buttons if you wanted to have more unbuttoned if you were wearing like a really beautiful bikini top or something underneath you could definitely unbutton it which would look really cute uh, the sleeves are super long and baggy which is beautiful and just feels so crazy and comfy and this is like the sand beige color it also comes in black and more of like a sort of like a burnt orange color from memory like a rust sort of color they're the three colors that comes in at the moment and they're all so beautiful but I thought I'd go with this one to start with it is literally going to be my go-to it literally feels like a big hug when you put it on and yeah obviously Super versatile to wear over togs or to wear in everyday life. And yes, I've still got my Connie's on and it looks really good with Connie's as well. Peep. <laughs> so yeah, you can definitely make this your own style with all your accessories and stuff. But I just think this is a must-have summer staple. So that brings us to the end of another Princess Polly haul. Thank you so much everyone for all your support always and for sticking around for another haul. These are definitely my favourite ones to film. They are so much fun and Princess Polly just has the best, most amazing, like versatile range of things that I get to play around with and style in all different ways which is so much fun. So yeah, big shout out to you guys for making this happen and for Princess Polly and Dana and all the team there for working with me. It is so, so much fun. And I just have the most fun like afterwards as well. Like I can't wait to go and wear all these things to all different like events and areas that I've like pictured and take really cool photos and yeah, it's just the best thing ever. So thank you so much everyone. If you enjoyed it, give me a thumbs up. That would mean the world. And if there's anything in particular you liked or if you have any questions about the fit or colour or whatever of anything, drop it in the comments and I'll definitely reply and help you guys out. But yeah, thank you so much. My discount code if you do want to buy anything and you don't need any help, <laughs> I'll just leave it in the description box. But it is XOLE20, all in caps, and I'll give you 20% off store wide, which is amazing and will definitely help out a lot at the checkout. So I'll see you guys in my next video. If you have any suggestions for videos that you'd like to see, please let me know and I'll be sure to make that happen. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.